John, how are you doing today? I'm doing very well, thank you. Give us the, the first time that you came across Mac, or Dr. John, as he is commonly referred to. My uncle had just returned from New Orleans, from living in New Orleans. And I was about 11, probably, or 10 or 11 years old. And at my grandmother's house, the record player was upstairs, and he had a tune that he wanted to play for my mum, who loved New Orleans music. And so the whole family gathered at the bottom of the stairs, and he put this record on. And I sort of decided there, there and then that I wanted to, to learn how to do that. That was it, really. I mean, I was already, in, already into music, but I just, that was the most beautiful thing I'd ever heard, I thought. And so that style, I found out, was New Orleans piano. And so when I was old enough to be able to do it, I set off to try and find out where that stuff came from where he learnt it from, really, that was my Off in the kind fantasy of quest. land somewhere, right? Yeah, yeah, I was a teenager. I just got out of school, got out of school early, and landed on my feet at, the, at a bar room where James Booker was the house <laughs> pianist, the Maple Leaf. And so that's sort of where my journey really started. But I remember hearing that, that music, and I just thought that was the most beautiful thing. <laughs> Such a night Such a night Sweet confusion Under the moonlight Such a night Such a night To steal away Yeah, you know You know that the time feels Such a night, such a night, sweet confusion, under the moonlight, such a night, such a night.
Ha ha! Jean Clear